This video is divided into sections that compass all of the bright oak locations and their quests alongside, the best farming location and the location and requirements of the merge shop. These sections are marked here on YouTube that you can scroll through to get to the part that you need. For rank 10 Arcan Grove click on the card. In slash join Rivensulf you will need to pick one of either chaos, evil, or good. It doesn't really matter what you pick. Here you need to go to the path that correlates with your previous choice. In quest 1 you need to go to the very end of the map. In quest 2 you need to kill 2 mushrooms and click on arrows on the map. In quest 3 you need to click on arrows in the next screen. In quest 4 you need to go to slash join pines and kill 4 pine grizzlies. After that, go to slash join cloister and kill 4 acorn ants. In quest 5 you need to kill 4 monsters of the map. In quest 6 you need to kill a mushroom and click on arrows around the map. In quest 7 just follow my lead. In quest 8 you need to kill Avida. After quest 8 you can go to slash join Elfheim. In Elfheim, quest 1 you need to kill 6 ruin stalkers and go to end screen. In quest 2 you need to slash join sand sea and buy a few water of life bottles. I advise around 6 to 8 to be safe. After that slash join bright oak and kill bright treant and wolf wood. This quest rewards an item that will be useful in a few later quests, so I advise you to do this quest a few times. Since it's an RNG quest, I can't give you a precise number. In quest 3 you will need to have the quest 3 reward and you'll need to kill 5 deer. In quest 4 you'll need to kill 12 ruined dwellers and go to slash join mudluck and complete the quest there. For the mudluck quest you'll need to slash join cloister and kill 15 acorn ants and 10 karasus. In quest 5 you'll need to kill 4 wolf riders and have 2 rewards from quest 2. For quest 6 you'll need to kill 12 ray twampuses. For quest 7 you'll need to kill 2 Rattlewampus, 3 Ruined Dwellers and get 3 rewards from quest 2. For quest 8 you'll need to have 4 rewards from quest 2 and kill 6 Ruined Stalkers. For quest 9 you'll need to complete the map's puzzle.
For quest 10 you need to kill the map boss. This is the quest that you want to farm. Now you can go do your quests in Dark Heart. For quest 1 you'll need to go to the end of the map. For quest 2 you'll need to kill 9 mutated leeches. For quest 3, kill 9 monsters in the map. For quest 4 you'll need to click on yellow lamps around the map and kill 5 Wisteroras. For quest 5 you'll need to kill 7 Toxic Grove Spiders and click on blue arrows around the map. For quest 6 you'll need to first kill 7 bright pool guardians in slash join bright oak and then go to slash join dark heart and click on blue arrows around the map. For quest 7 you'll need to kill 8 tainted earth, 5 toxic grove spiders, and 6 mutated leeches. For quest 8 click on arrows on the map. For quest 9 kill the boss. This boss quest is also a quest that you can farm. Now you can go to slash join Gaiazor and merge the stone crusher. For this merge you will need to get rank 10 myth song, rank 10 arcangrove and rank 10 bright oak. To get fast myth song rep you'll have to complete all of the myth song storyline quests, but don't worry, they're not gonna take long. Get to Kimberly at slash join Palooza and accept the Kimberly quest and defeat her. Kimberly is an easy monster to kill and if you farm the quest with a rep boost or during a server boost, getting rank 10 myth song is not gonna take a long time. You get 2000 rep points per quest, and to defeat Kimberly takes a minute, so that's 120k base reputation per hour. If you farm during a server boost with a rep boost you will complete the faction within an hour. Like.